Alrighty, hello, hello. Welcome to another Malekith episode with me, Ash and Ninja. You should subscribe to my channel just because I say so. No other reason, really. Alrighty, so Malekith was on his way back down here again. Now, bring him down here and put him into ambush stance. Since they, since he seems to be buggering off, we might be able to get Arnheim off him. If this goes well. Which, it probably won't, because these things never seem to. But anyway... We'll get that sort of thing done. There's more high elf armies down that way. And you, man Tresser. You want to head this way. Out to the wreck. Yeah, we just want to resolve that one. She'll be right. Get her out of those waters. We should be able to take Toran like pretty easily anyway. So even with a bit of damage. Uh, Ferianor can t wait there still. You're just waiting for stuff to sort itself out here, aren't you? Yes. So it looks like we've got stuff sorted there for now. So let's continue her out. So that's in a positive state at the moment. Could be because of something else, but that's fine. I'm still going to accept it. Uh, get him a survivalist. Uh, man, Tressa. That was a nice level for you. Oh, and take the instrument of war. Alrighty, now we do have a black arc down here. Your demise is certain. That should be a Pretty easy, uh, thought so. I require slaves. Sail damn you. A black hearted Alright, Admiral. Uh what is a good one for him? So he's got lots of shades on there with him. So we'll go with raid leader. For him. Uh, obsidian peaks. Yeah, well, yeah, yeah, yeah. Now that's money. Anything good here? Some fur. Hmm. Nothing hmm. else that gets us money would be nice. Actually, maybe I'll we'll go for torture posts. Bit more public order there, pretty low public order there. Uh, yeah, we'll upgrade that here. Can't get more masters at the moment. We should be able to get another assassin since one of them was killed. If we have somewhere where we can actually recruit assassins. Here we go. Uh, strong, tough, malevolent. Doesn't really matter. Malicious and cruel. Now that I think about it, let's just leave him up here. A black hearted rogue. Uh well, still had another point to spend. So for now we'll leave him up there. That all look pretty good. Uh, the garrisons, elf garrisons are generally not too great. Mm, Silverhounds, Dragon Princes, Sea Guard, Kate Guard, yeah. Yeah, super fine. Master of it's not much of a capital for us to take because it's red territory, but we'll still take it anyway. Ah, oh, excellent, they took Arnheim. 
means we can go through Bleakhold Fortress and then take Arnheim off them. That's a nice jumping off point to hit Ulthwan as well. So Bleakhold for Fortress is the next stop on our journey of awesome. And having them locked up in Arnheim means we can just take out that army with relative ease. Who seeks me? I seek you. Row, damn it. Yep, row, damn it. What's best for me? Ah, it's what is best tail. for you? What are you asking? What kind of I question is that? The ocean awaits. Bring him around. Keep an eye on what's going on here. Ooh, look at that. There's lots of stuff down here. They shouldn't have gone away from Mr. Malekith. He's gonna take your little tiny Tricky. fortress. Disreputable curse! That's right, we are disreputable curs. Thank you. Thank you for noticing. It's about time somebody noticed my disreput disreputableness. Yeah, you'd like to try and assassinate something, wouldn't you? There you go. Lovely. Everybody likes to assassinate things every now and then. Oh, Death Hag, Masigha, is that like a weird messiah? Hmm. Hold on. Tenacity will do for now. A worthy Soon, Tor and A bit of specialist for you. Quad Coast. Yeah, a bit of that. And a bit more of that. Excellent. Can't get any more masters at the moment. Master and debater. Mother of the Dark Convent. Yeah, Mother of the Dark Convent. You can still hang around here. I think. I think he think. Coolios. Pushing ahead nicely. What are you gonna do? Hmm. Oh, yeah, okay. Running away. Malekith will keep fighting down here. He'll just kind of follow that Elf Lord around. And whatever the Elf Lord takes, he'll take off the Elf Lord until the Elf Lord stops taking shit. In which case, he'll kill the Elf Lord and feel much better about his spell. They want a defensive alliance. But I don't like being defensive. I prefer an offensive alliance. Where you just try and be as offensive to, as possible to each other. Alright, let's have a look. Mantressa. Uh, nah, nah. Ooh, that's that. Slave to climb, minus 20 all provinces for 10 turns. But there's a chance to lose loyalty. On start, all lords have a chance to gain loyalty. I'll just go with that one. I'm happy with the status quo. As long as it benefits me, of course. My time. Uh, you can join My Mantressa. And so there's quite a lot of ranged units here. She doesn't have the best stuff for dealing with I that. will destroy them what does their oh yeah no they're easy to deal with those ones the weak shall fall shouldn't be a problem Oop. peeling skin off my finger ow ah. Yes, the flap, the, the, 
pad of my finger encountered something sharp yesterday at work. Therefore, it's not in 100% condition today. Alright, let's set up over in this corner. So we can take down this tower. I don't know where they will be setting up, but... This works for me. Get our shades all kind of crowded here with the spearmen. Uh, hop you and you up front for tanking duties. Don't need anything. Auto shot. Nope. That's the wrong one. We want that one. Multi shot. Good, good. I'll take this tower out. Okay, so to be able to shoot down the line, I need to be able to put my belt throwers. Whoops! No, 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 no! Come back where you were. How much do I have left? Not a huge amount of ammo left. Oh, I didn't actually use up much. Alright, let's try shooting at this other tower, taking it out. So I want to be able to position them so I can shoot down the line here. Yeah, the finger thing I was talking about before is being a bit annoying now. Alright, let's see what do you have. Power of Darkness. Chill Wind and Chill Blade, none of which will really help us a huge amount in the scenario we have here. Just because I can't use any of those on walls. Alright, let's see how much damage we can do to these guys. Down the line shooting. That's good, run them off. Uh, yep, North and Seagar taking a beating. I just want to be able to get my shade so that I can fire with them as well. Uh, that should be done. Only four of them left. Fire! Pew pew pew! Yes! Really rather they were shooting down that side. Okay, let's see. Let's take one of these units of shades. Because that's both white lines.
Cleaning them out nicely. Beautiful. Hidden units are revealed, but that's all right. Not even reacting to them anyway. Now we move in so we can shoot at them instead. Doing any damage with those shots, are we? No, not really. Alright, we'll go back to just shooting these ones, which we're not really doing a great deal of damage to now, but we've got almost no, no uh, ammo left, so that's alright. Good, good. I mean, they're a damaged unit anyway, so 112 kills for a damaged unit, pretty good, damn good. Bring out one of these other units. We still have bolt thrower ammo as well, if I need to use it. Shouldn't really need to though. Alrighty. On to these white lines. White lines have a little bit of... Yeah, missile resistance, 30%. Right. Battery is down to 50%, oh no! Now the white lines always have that, missile resistance. This is why missile resistance is better than, <coughs> better than shields. Shields are directional, missile resistance is not. It's about all that really makes white lions okay. And okay is about as good as they are. Ah, the white lions unit getting torn up. That's good. What I like to see. Just volleys of arrows making that unit smaller every time. Get through our damaged units first. <laughs> I'd like to be able to start shooting at the no, we want to be standing more over this way, get behind them a bit more. We just be able to target them better. That's good. Nice and close in there. Just a few more left. There we go, another unit wiped out. That's good. Only I could get range on those there. That'd be nice. Oh well, let's get you moving up. Yeah, both of them moving up as well. Whoop. Everybody up. Got them where we want them, I think. Uh, let's hit that unit. Go. 
Good bit of repositioning. I'll be back. I forgot their hat. Uh, only 11 of them left. Maybe we can uh, finish them off just with the bolt throwers. Ooh, we can finish off the tower, apparently. Didn't even realise I'd been hitting it. Oh, he'll be out of ammo soon. Okay, so let's get everyone over here. Everyone that matters. What we'll do, even though these guys aren't siege attackers, we can still get them bashing on the door. We'll move them back. I want to see where they end up. You and you start knocking on the front door. That'll take a while. Meanwhile, let's see if we can get a blade wind through there. Oh, look at that. Uh, not a lot of damage, but what about one of these? How much damage will you do? Uh, again, not a lot. Alright. That looks good. Looks like a very good spot to go and uh, make a nuisance of ourselves. And we'll fire at these white lions. Gate destroyed. Oh, beautiful. White lions you didn't like being shot up by them, did they? How much melee do they have left? Okay, so it's mostly dudes on horses now, so... Heroes get to go fight some gate guard. Oh, and a noble. I forgot about the noble. We are ready. Understood. Understood. We understand. At once. Shades. No fear. By my spear. Fury. Yep, go hit them. Right, you're out of here now. Make them bleed. We bring up the rest of our shades. They're mostly up there just to occupy them. Absolutely destroy those gate guard. Massacre them.
If I must, the deal is in debt. Yeah, beautiful. All right, all you guys, don't worry about the walls now. Onwards to murder. Split them open. Where to? Okay. Very well. Understood. As you wish. Yeah, he's not actually taking a huge amount of damage from him right now. Murder awaits. Right. He has taken a lot of damage, so that's good. Red spears. Shades. Advancing. Put our shades all up here. For all. To their graves. Death hag. Warrior. Trickery and deception. Master Druki. Wage war. Come on. Go and get him, you two. Jeez. Almost got him. There he goes. Alright, let's see if we can get these silver helms or whoever they are in range. I don't know if we can. Oh, yeah, they're in range. There we go. Victory is in our grasp. No surprises there. We can take these guys out. We should be able to assemble everyone else in here and then slaughter them as they come at us. Or as we go at them. Whichever one. Uh, the on, on the plus side, shades are actually okay in melee. So we should be able to still beat them. Oh, yep. Bye bye, silver helms. Just wipe him out anyway, just to be sure. Or oh, stand around like luckless morons, whatever. There we go. Eager for battle. Let's get the rest of yous in here now. Going. Once. Put on some auto shooting. The merciless host. Carnage awaits. Carnage awaits. Master Druki! Striding! Seeking entertainment! Seeking entertainment! Just a bit out of range there. So much for auto shot. They won't last very long. They're doing their best to just hide there. 
Dragon Princes, none of them are interested in coming out, so... May as well just shoot them where they stand. Lazy bastards. Alrighty, now we have a foothold on Ulthwan. Be it a shit one, but... A foothold nonetheless. Gets us in the game. Be able to prevent them from getting the sort of cane back if we uh Take you are what not little worthy. they have. Yep. Supreme sorceress of Grant. If we do it right, so repair that. We're not gonna have slaves here for now, so no need for that. We'll get walls in, we'll go over here to the slaves and we'll say no, no more slaves. Why is Black Coast getting slaves? You don't get slaves. Good. Dark sorceress. Black hearted dreadlord. Sail damn you. At the moment you can just hang there. Have a dread expansion. You're gonna assassinate him? Well, you're gonna try and fail. King of the Truki. You'll move up here a bit. Death awaits them. Don't want to alarm them with our presence. So we'll move slowly. Supreme Sorceress of Grond. The Supreme Sorceress of Grond, apparently. Uh, let's see, what do we have here? Seems there's a big red glowy sword in the water there. Obviously they didn't like us uh, coming in to fight over here. Uh, let's give you... doesn't really matter what we give him, does it? Uh, give him Stalker, just in case he ends up in an army. You never know when these things will happen. Uh, let's see... Go with Serve or Die. Uh, master. Hard to hit Master. Do some quick building as well. Lots of public order for the Clark Harond. Yep, I think that's a good idea. Bit of that. Yes, please. Righty oh. Well, there we go. That's it for this episode. So we have now taken Tor and Lek. And, uh, yeah, that's where we're at. So, if you like this episode, please subscribe. Just subscribe anyway, no matter what. That's what I say. And, uh, hopefully, we will be furthering our expedition into Ulthuan and next episode. So, I shall see you then. Until then, hope you have a good one. See you later.